and if proof were needed that Prince Harry's Woe Is Me Act has bored the world to death, look no further than the hotel rooms and sunbeds of foreign holiday resorts. So this is hilarious. Tour operator on the beach has revealed that more than 100 copies of his tell-all memoir, Spare, have been left abandoned at hotels across Spain, Turkey and Greece, leaving the firm struggling to give them away. Company boss Zoe Harris said her team had, quote, never witnessed anything quite like it. And it follows a rough few months for the Sussexes, not least after being dumped from their £20 million Spotify deal, called effing grifters by a top exec, and reports yesterday they are sailing towards financial turmoil and living in hell in Montecito. What, so what do you think? Does uh, this prove Prince Harry's efforts to win over the public have failed? Dan at GBNews.com voted our poll at GB News on Twitter. The results shortly, but doing battle on this now. Broadcaster supporter of Harry and Meghan, Nina Mishkov, and the socialite and royal expert, Lady Victoria Harvey. So, uh, Lady V, what does this suggest? That people are like, oh, God, I'm going to have to give this a go, but they have no interest in actually taking the book with them? Because apparently mm. uh, it's dumped more than any other book in the world. So. Right. Yeah, I mean, look, it had a lot of sales, but it's the highest dumped book as well. I think, you know, people were just sick of hearing about him complaining and whining and just being so spoiled. They, but also, look, they might have read it and then they might have like got halfway through and just decided they're dumping it because they just don't want to carry it back, right? So, so wherever they live, they've just left it for the next person. <laughs> Nina, this, this was quite telling, wasn't yeah. it? No, absolutely not. You're misinterpreting this. Oh. I mean, if, you, if you're lying around a pool and you see all these other copies being read, mm. you know you're reading the... The, the book of the summer. You, you've got yours right I've there. Got my, oh, you've got it with you. So you never look, dumped it. No, of course. Of course. Why, well, I didn't read it on holiday. I don't mm. take hardbacks on holiday. Mm. And the reason for that, Victoria, because you probably go in private well, jets. But if you not, go on easy jet, if you go on easy jet or Ryanair or any yeah. or or any of the uh, <laughs> ones you go to, your yeah. hand luggage this is, heavy. Is, is ten kilos. Yeah. This yeah. is over a pound and a half. Right. You're not going to take okay. a hardback. But okay, but so if you do, if you do make the effort, you buy it okay. at the airport mm. so that it's not, it's not okay. part of your luggage. You take and it. And so you think it's a planned thing. Okay, or, but look, there's a broader point here, though, yeah, I, Lady I, v, which, which is that things just don't seem to be working out. I just, yeah, look, I think their the luck is just running out at this point and people are just seeing through him and them as a couple and they don't want to be part of it anymore. The thing is, Don't you think? you're talking about, you, know, yeah. you, you want to broaden up, but we are talking right. about the book. Mm. The book is currently at number mm. eight in the New York Times bestseller list. Mm. It's been there for 27 weeks. If you go mm. on the Amazon website, bestsellers of the or year, maybe what number one is, Pete, is spare. If you if you look... But maybe they're, they're just, like, realising yeah. they just don't need to yeah, buy when, more copies because the copies I, are everywhere, right, when already? I, when, I, when, I go, when, people, when people go on holiday, they buy a book okay. at the airport. Okay. But, 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 but they leave it behind. But this isn't about the book. But if it's a book that you really love, like, when I get a book and I really love it, even if it's a big book and I'm on holiday, if I really love that book, I will fly back. I will take back. But lots of people... So they just basically abandon them, right? But, Lady V, isn't there a bigger point here, which is that there seems to be a waning influence. The New York Post's mm. uh, page six, which is very tapped in, mm. actually, to Harry and Meghan, reporting that actually their life is a living hell in Montecito because they're so concerned about how they can pay... Look, the I, I've, spent, I've been to Montecito a couple of times and it is boring. There's nothing mm. to do. There's that, there's that one main road. I don't know if you've both been... It, there's this no, one road with a I've few restaurants Barbara, on. And it's, there, it's delightful. There, there's a road with a few restaurants on, and then that road literally goes onto a highway. Like, there's nothing there. Yes, but you could say there's nothing there at Sandringham. No, no, but it's you not could, pretty. You like people, ha people imagine that it's I mean, pretty. It's no, not pretty. No, never. Santa Barbara is beautiful. Mm. I, I love know, Santa but, Barbara. And but in, is it the issue that yeah. I've lost all of these big contracts and They've now? Lost they're struggling and to the, see how they no, can they've, maintain they've lost this Spotify, lifestyle. but then so did the Obamas, and the Obamas are hardly struggling, are they? No, they, they are living a happy life. Well, well that the one place that they were hanging they, out in L.A., they actually, like I heard from people in L.A., that they actually got barred. What you know, happened? Well, the private members club where they organised to have paparazzi outside in West Hollywood, they're not allowed to go back. Really? Well, so, 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 yeah. so, sorry, a private members club... Banned Harry and Meghan because they secretly they asked were, for paparazzi. Yeah, because they it's, secretly it's, asked. Are you sure? You know, it's it's the one that they, they that's tittle go to. No, no, no. I know people in LA. Like yes, I've lived there for a long time. It's are not. You it's true. Lady V's sources. Yes, I do. 
OK, I do, well, I let's mean, try and Look, this find is a, 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 a very tenuous story. Yeah, it's a yeah. private member's club. No, no, no. Club. No, they, they don't like... Pa the other people there do not like paparazzi, well, right? Don't, but don't so they brought the, paparazzi with them. They, had, they, they would have, do set-up shots. The, 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 the fact that, you, that they would bring paparazzi, they load they the paparazzi. They do. They, they do the set-up shots no, all the time. But, Nina, lots they, of people have been saying that, that Meghan has set up a lot of shots. What about that fake story? What about the fake story with the driving in the car? Oh, that was, that was, that made was up. not a fake story. That was not a fake story. The fantasy car chase. The fantasy right? car chase. You, you think that was real? Happened, where it's it impossible wasn't... to get above, you know, 10 yeah. miles per hour. In certain places, you can, in Riverside, you, you, can, you can get up speed. You're, you're, the, you're, you're very loyal. So, so yeah. no way needed. Loyal no defender. Way needed. Yeah. No, no, absolutely not. The thing is, how much influence do they want? I think they are leading a happy San life. San Vicente Bungalow. Sorry, down. I've just remembered the name. Everything is quite. What's, what's down. the name? San Vicente Bungalows. So you should try and reach out to them and say, is this, is this a true? OK. Little scoop there from yep. Lady Victoria Harvey. Uh, thank you to Janina Mishkov. Who do you agree with?